Andrew Warren is speaking out tonight about running for re-election as Hillsborough County State Attorney. He made the announcement yesterday. The twice-elected Democrat was suspended by Governor Ron DeSantis back in 2022. The governor claimed Warren was refusing to uphold certain laws, including Florida's restrictions on abortion. Warren, however, called the decision a political stunt. News Channel East Nicole Rogers sat down with Warren this morning and joins us now live in Tampa with what he had to say. Nicole. Jen, Andrew Warren made two things clear. The first is that he believes voters should have the final say on who sits in this office. And the second, he says that he does not need what he called a permission slip from the governor to speak out on hot button issues like abortion. I was suspended because of an illegal, unlawful political stunt by the governor. Andrew Warren now speaking out after announcing he will be running for re-election as state attorney in Hillsborough County, a job Governor Ron DeSantis suspended him from back in 2022. Well, the conduct that he has done has fell below the standard that's required in the Florida Constitution. When you're not, when you're saying you're not going to enforce certain laws you don't like, that's a neglect of duty. I have to do this. I mean, that's my job to ensure that the laws are faithfully executed. Warren claims the suspension violated his freedom of speech and cannot be the basis for his removal. My suspension was unjust because it was part of a political stunt. The governor didn't have the power to suspend me and he violated my constitutional rights by suspending me for speaking out on issues of importance, primarily on a woman's right to choose. So would you still enforce laws you don't agree with? I will do the same thing that I've always done as a federal prosecutor and as your state attorney. I will enforce the law and exercise my discretion based on the facts and circumstances of every case to make Hillsborough County the safest possible place to raise our family. But back in January, Warren announced he would not be running for re-election, saying if he won, the governor would simply just remove him again. So what changed? What changed is that appellate court opinion that upheld the law. By affirming the illegality of the suspension and that the court has the power to reinstate me, the court made clear that the governor can't just throw out people's votes for whatever reason he cooks up and that the will of the voters matters. Coming up at 6, Warren touches on his legal battle with Governor Ron DeSantis and what comes next. Live in Tampa, Nicole Rogers, 8 on your side.